in this video we are going to cover the fortnite ultimate fps boost pack so guys welcome to my channel make sure to watch my this whole video because this video includes some important registry no any kind of third party tool so this video is completely safe for any kind of pc build so with wasting any time let's dive straight into our this video so in the very first step we are going to set our dedicated gpu on our primary gpu for the gaming so for that you need to open up your task manager so right click here on your taskbar and open up the task manager and there you will find out the section you need to go for the performance tab and there you will find out gpu 0 and gpu 1 now here is our gpu 0 which is the intel ultra actually graphics and we need best performance our cpu so therefore we are going to disable this gpu of the intel so for that close out this window and you need to simply go for your device manager simply go over your search bar and search for device manager now go for display adapter and click on this drop down and before disabling this intel hd graphics 770 from your pc it's most important you have installed your correct driver of your dedicated gpu whether it is nvidia amd whatever that is make sure you have a dedicated gpu otherwise your screen will be go black so therefore make sure to right click here on your intel hd graphics and click on to the disable device and click yes so we have successfully disabled our Intel HD graphics after that close out your device manager. Now in the next step guys, you need to download this ultimate Fortnite FPS boost pack on your PC. Link available down in the description. Open up the link and it will take you onto my this website. And there you will find out the same exact article with the same thumbnail of my YouTube video you are watching right now. Open up that article and download this pack on your PC. After the downloading, right click here. Go for extract here and extract the folder out of this boost pack. Now open up this folder and inside here you will find out multiple folders which is restore point, power plan, command fix, gaming optimization, registry settings, clean, junk files and fortnite config files. So in the very first step it's most important to create a restore point on your PC. So double tap on this folder and double tap onto the restore and go for your local DC, go for the configure, turn on system protection and set it on to the 5%. After that, hit apply and click OK. Now go for this create button and name it anything. So I am putting here Ripex. Click on this create button and create the restore point on your PC. After creating the restore point, click on this close button and close out system property window. And go for our first boost pack optimization step and that is the power plan. Open up this folder and go for the power tweaks.re file. Double tap here. Click yes and click OK again. Now go for the power option and from here set it on to the ultimate performance power plan. If you not have the ultimate performance power plan, make sure to select out the Bitsum high performance on your PC. And for creating this power plan, you can go on my YouTube channel and watch this video how to create the Bitsum high performance power plan on your PC. After you successfully created this power plan, now check mark on this power plan and close out your power window. Now go back and open up the next folder which is the command tweaks. Double tap here and inside here you will find out disable useless activity of your windows and important tweaks. And guys before running these tweaks it's important you need to disable your antivirus because if you do any changes in your windows registry so that will cause the problem. So for that you need to open up your windows start icon. Go for your windows settings. Now go for update and security. Open up windows securities. Go for virus and threat protection. Open up manage settings and turn off real time protection and press yes. Now you need to minimize the security window because after all the optimization we will turn it on. Now here is our disabled use the activity right click here and run this as administrator and click yes and here we done. Now go for important fix run this as administrator and guys here we are done and this is disabling the power saving feature from your PC and also optimizing your network and all the PC settings. Now after that go back into the main directory of this boost pack and in the next folder here we have the gaming optimization registry tweaks. So open up this folder and inside here you will find out disabled driver searching. Double tap, install this registry and after that guys one by one install all of this registry on your PC and this will give you a huge performance increase on your PC after installing all these registry on your PC because it include high priority file, disable energy logging, disable energy estimation, disable windows telemetry, disable the power plotting of your cpu and your gpu and after that here is the keyboard data queue and the mouse data queue settings for reducing the latency of your mouse and keyboard now after that go back into the main directory and in the next step here we find out clean junk file now double tap here and inside here you will find out this clean app shortcut double tap here select out your c drive and now we are going to delete all of the junk data from our pc after all this optimization now go for the option which is the clean up system files click ok 
Now select out here this folder which is the Windows updated screen up, check mark on this folder, scroll down, find out delivery optimization, check mark here, also check mark on to the DirectX shadow cache. Check mark onto the temporary windows installation file and here is the thumbnail I suggest you to uncheck it. Then click on the ok button and click delete files. And this will start cleaning all of the junk and temporary files from your windows. So once this cleanup is complete now you need to again open up your fortnite fps boost pack and here is our final and the last step for this boost pack and that is the fortnite config file open up this folder and inside here you will find multiple folders according to the different pc builds so you need to choose it wisely according to your hardware and according to your gpu and cpu or you can ask me in the comment section according to your pc build i will suggest you to best config for your pc so guys here is the high end pc low end pc mid end pc and very low end and very 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 low and pieces so you need to open up the file according to your pc build right click here on the game settings click on this copy button and after that now press windows r together from your keyboard you will find out this run window now simply type your percentage local add data percentage and press enter now scroll down until you find out fortnite games folder saved config windows client and right click here and paste it here and replace your file destination after replacing this file now close out it and close out this boost pack and now you can simply remove these files from your pc after the installation of this boost pack now you can enable back your windows security settings so again go in your settings go for update and security go for windows security open up virus and threat protection Go for manage settings and turn on the real tech protection again on your PC. And now guys, after all of these optimization, now just one time restart your PC. Therefore, all the settings will take effect. And after that, launch your Fortnite and enjoy the best performance out of your PC. And guys, here is the gameplay after the optimization of this method. I hope so you love it. Please make sure to drop a like on this video and share your opinion about this optimization in the comment section. And till the next video, peace out.